up in trucking. Uh, my dad was a trucker, my grandpa, my uncles. Um, I had one aunt, I think, was a truck driver. Um, but yeah, I mean, as from a young age. So, I was always, you know, wanting to help daddy wash the truck, wash the wheels, and riding with him at a young age. I can remember probably maybe five years old, six years old, riding with him. Um, you know, he worked for them uh, big companies, I don't know if you heard of them, Baggett Transportation, Ross Neely, Consolidated Freightway, uh, Yellow Freight Line, overnight. Um, he even hauled lumber. Uh, and that's actually what I learned on, uh, was actually a, a cab over, a uh, flatbed. My dad was always a big cab over fan, and uh, he loved the cab overs. But anyway, he, uh, he taught me how to drive, and I think when I was like, 15 or 16, I guess, maybe. It was 13 speed. Um, of course, I grind some gears, but, you know, who doesn't? So, yeah, anyway, uh, yeah, he taught me at a young age, and like I said, I grew up around it. Um, in and out of trucks, you know, my, my whole kid life and teenage life. But anyway, um, I was a land surveyor. If you know what anybody know what that means, but I worked outside for 20 years, made pretty good money at it. Um, and then after that, I uh, cut meat. I was a butcher, basically a meat cutter for a living for like seven years. So that's two traits, plus truck driving. Uh, anyway, um, originally from Georgia, Atlanta, Georgia, and I moved to uh, just about an hour east of Phoenix, out near Mesa, a little town called Santan Valley, Arizona. And uh, everyone knows, you know, surveying jobs and the meat cutting. I got tired of it and saw an ad for uh, Will Train. Uh, well, pre approved hire, hiring for Warner. Warner uh, Enterprises. Yeah, go figure. But uh, like I said, I'm not no typical driver. I learned at a young age. But anyway, uh, they wanted to go to truck driving school, AIT, which is out of the Phoenix. So I paid the, I think it was $4,186, $4,100.86. Uh, four week class, two weeks in class, two weeks road range, and then they, you know, you go get your CDL, and then you go to the training class with Warner. Uh, I had a really good trainer, uh, but he didn't have, you know, to really work with him that much because I knew a lot. But he just taught me the ins and outs and do's and don'ts, whatnot. But real good trainer. Guy's, guy's name's Jason Frizzle. 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 I think it's Frizzle. But anyway, he still works with Warner. And, uh, you know, I did, I was supposed to do, I think you're supposed to do f six weeks, six or seven weeks of training. And I think I came out in five weeks, maybe, four weeks, four and a half, five weeks. Um, but, yeah, uh, like I said, I really had a really good trainer. And then, uh, so I started working for Warner. Uh, I, was a, I was a dock bumper and a, a door swinger. <laughs> Not anymore. Uh, run open deck. But anyway, um, yeah, I mean, I had a really good trainer and uh, listened a lot and asked a bunch of questions and got out of the truck, got my own truck, and then actually went to, I went did a year with Warner, and then I did an owner operator company for a year and a half called We Try Trucking. Uh, it was out of Phoenix, basically, you haul Warner Freight. And then uh, and went back to Warner. You know, for the company Warner, uh, and then worked for another owner-operator company called uh, Red Hog Express. Red Hog Express, out of uh, Blair, Nebraska. Anyway, and, uh, let's see where was uh Oh yeah, Warner. So anyway, I ended up working for Warner for I guess a little over six years, seven years, something like that. And then uh, had a buddy of mine that was working for Valley Transportation running drive in. So he called me and told me about it and I put an application in and went to orientation. And I ran van with Valley for the first year, a little over a year, a year and a month, a year and two months. And I run real good. Uh, nice equipment. Everything's nice about it. I mean the company, I love it. And the people I've got hired on with the company, which is two, at least two, I think. But anyway, yeah. Now, after, like I said, first year.
chains and straps, which I've never done before, you know, so now I run open deck and I will not go back to van. But yeah, I mean, April 29th will be two years with Valley Transportation and I love it. Anyway, uh, for those of you who want to hear my trucker's journey, I guess that's what you meant, I guess. I don't know. Um, not a very long one, but I'll, I'll post this little one out there and hope you enjoyed it. Maybe that answers some of your questions. But anyway, I, I can tell you the kind of trucks I've driven. I mean, I've driven cab overs, eights, eight, nine overs, uh, nine speeds, ten speeds, super tens. I drove thirteens and eighteens. Eighteens now because that's what I drive is an eighteen.